Uh, it is an Easter like no other for our troops overseas. Military chaplains coming up with unique ways to mark this holy day safely, including drive up communion right after the live streamed mass at a U.S. post in Japan. Joining us now, the man behind that idea, Lieutenant Colonel Don Erke, chaplain for the U.S. Army garrison at Camp Zama in Japan. Chaplain, good morning. Thanks so much for doing this. We saw what you were doing morning, and we Sam. thought we're our viewers would love yes happy easter to you we thought our viewers would love to hear what you are doing for our troops overseas on this easter sunday yes uh, we're doing some uh, remarkable things some creative things uh doing things a little differently than uh, we normally do uh but the community's really responded well to it uh, you mentioned the drive up communion our catholic priest father arizari uh, he came up with that idea and uh, because it's so important to receive communion. And at first I thought, yeah, I, I laughed. And then I thought, well, that's just crazy enough to work. And really, just how inspired. And indeed, the communities responded well. The cars line up uh, every Sunday after Mass. Uh, they stay in their vehicles, and uh, they are all able to receive communion. They receive the blessing from Father Irizarry. And also our Protestant uh, folks are also doing the same thing as well. Uh, it's just a matter of uh, thinking creatively, thinking differently. Uh, we don't have a, a, a game plan we can fall upon from last year. Uh, it's just people coming up with good ideas and implementing those ideas and taking, uh, taking advantage of what there is still available for us to do, even as we are practicing social distancing. Chaplain, what is the troop morale throughout all of this? Our troop morale is really high. Uh, our folks are 100 percent behind uh, leadership and uh, people understand exactly uh, what they need to do uh, to uh, keep themselves safe and more importantly also to keep one another safe. Uh, this is a community uh, effort. It's very collaborative and people have kept their spirits high. Uh, sometimes it's really uh, difficult to especially see the news from back in the states. Uh, I don't think there is any family here that is uh, not impacted by what's happening in America, uh, but yet we keep our hopes high. We're very resilient, and we, we we stay strong. That is a very positive message and something wonderful to hear on this Easter morning, Chaplain. And we've been showing pictures there of Camp Zama and the and, and the services that have been going on. These drive up services yes. and even little Easter bags were there to hand out. So you pull up in your car, just like the drive-in movie, and you tune into the, the to the station there, and you hear this service, and you go away with your Easter bag. Leave us off with the response that you've been getting to all this. It's been fantastic. People really responded well. They loved it. They loved the idea. Uh, for those of us who remember drive-ins, uh, yes, it, it has that feel. Yeah. Uh, people drove up. They got their Easter bag uh, that volunteers put together, and we made sure it was, was done uh, uh, with, with great care to make sure we didn't spread the virus. It was uh, done very carefully. And they tuned in to FM 88.9 and were able to hear us uh, through the transmitter uh, and stayed together in with one another inside their cars, but still together as a community as well. Uh, it's so important to keep, even as we're practicing social distancing, that we still have that sense of community is still there. And I think people really have uh, the responses. They really felt like they had an opportunity to worship together as a group, even as mm. we were separate in our cars and doing it over the radio, uh, there is that sense of belonging and togetherness. Uh, that we so long for and it's so important for us as a part of our faith to practice. Chaplain Erke, you're also Lieutenant Colonel Donald Erke. We thank you for your service. Thank you for everything that you're doing you. for our troops and for the community there to keep their, their spirits high during these difficult times. Thank you, Chaplain. Thank you and God bless.